Tap full screen icon on the video bottom right corner for better experience. Creating realistic intro animation. Using CapKit Mobile Video Editor, open CapCut. Tap on New Project. Go to Stock Videos, select Animation, and tap the Add button. Tap on Overlay and add green screen overlay video. This green screen is free and you can use it on YouTube channel. Video download link is in the description. Add video footage for the green screen frame. Tap on video and remove the green screen. Green screen is removed. Now you can see the background video clip. Adjust the video footage with the frame size. We have created the first clip. Save it to the gallery. Tap on green screen video and search for replace option. Add another green screen video and replace it with the current. Don't need to remove the green screen again. Click on the background video and replace it too. Adjust background video with the frame size. Second video is ready. Save it to the gallery. Repeat the same steps for other green screen videos. I have created seven clips for my intro. Close CapKit and create a new project. Add all created videos to the new project. Seven video clips that we created I added to the new project. Change each video speed to little bit faster. I am going with 2x. This step is optional. You can skip it. Adding audio to the CapKit project. Select the background music from your device and add to the project. Adding match beat to the audio. Tap on the audio layer and choose match cut. Now select your beat position on the audio and add a beat. You can also use the auto generate option. CapKit will generate the beats automatically. Repeat the same step. I have added 12 beats. You can see the yellow dots below the audio layer. Match the time indicator with the beat and cut video at the same position.
There are 12 beats in the audio and we have created just 7 clips. That's why I am adding the same clips again. some animation to the videos, then it will look so realistic. Tap on the video and move the time indicator to the beginning of the video. Now add keyframe at the beginning. Now move the time indicator to the end of the selected video and add some movement to the video. The second keyframe will add automatically. Repeat the same steps for other videos. Make sure to add a different animation to each video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you never miss an update from us. You can download the green screen video by clicking the link in the description. It's free and you can use it on your YouTube channel.